Well, nearly a year and a half after the pandemic changed our lives, we're beginning to see some normalcy. That's in part thanks to Arizona Western College's nursing students and faculty. Yeah, tonight News 11's Arled Youssef brings us a special report on just how the college's nursing program contributed to COVID-19 testing and vaccinations. Yuma County needed all hands on deck when the pandemic hit. AWC nursing students joined forces with medical professionals to take on the challenge. Drastic times call for drastic measures. AWC faculty and students answered the call when COVID-19 struck Yuma County. Going through a global pandemic and being in the healthcare field, that's frightening. Going through a global pandemic and entering the healthcare field as a student is something entirely different. None of us knew that we'd be walking into something like this. I don't think anybody, you know, foresaw it. Walking into the unknown together, even though there were some reservations. Where there was some hesitancy at the beginning, um, I did not see that, not even remotely towards the end. Everybody just was ready to help and get in there. And there's so many people that need our help, and that includes the healthcare workers. From then on, it was go time. The Yuma County Public Health Services District approached AWC for help. 70 students and four faculty members volunteered their time and efforts to the county, a total of almost 1,200 hours. When the semester started, uh, they actually are the ones that were very instrumental in actually going to, you know, to the public health department on their days off because they still had to come into class. They still had to go to some clinicals. Many nursing students had only experienced one normal semester out of the four semester program. With traditional clinicals out of the question, changes had to be made to prepare these future healthcare workers. Clinicals were out. So in March, thanks to our leadership, they were able to buy interactive uh, programs for our students, what they call virtual simulations. Still, if they could help students and the community at the same time, they wanted to do it. We took that opportunity at the time because we were allowed to by the Arizona Board of Nursing that we can use that as a clinical. Students were ready to be a part of the solution. It was a privilege more than anything. It was an excellent learning opportunity because it put us face to face with and with our community. So because of the pandemic, some of our learning opportunities had changed. Um, and when they were able to implement us going out to these sites and doing these things, um, we were able to participate in tons of care, which was amazing because the public really needed it. In addition to assisting the health department with COVID testing sites and vaccination sites, a virtual simulation program was incorporated in spring of 2020, allowing students to work with a system that presents real world health scenarios. With COVID came loss as well. So we weren't able to do all of the same things, but I absolutely think that these experiences not only make up for it, they add, to, they add something to us as nurses. We're going to be ready to tackle things and be flexible because we've had to do that. There was still a sense of community, even during some of the worst times. A really pleasant surprise how happy everybody was um, and how grateful they were not only for the vaccination, but the opportunity to talk to somebody and ask questions or you know even say things that they really hadn't been able to say um, because they've been home alone or they just don't have those people to talk to at the moment. As a result, we see the light at the end of the tunnel. Do you see the PPE get vaccinated? We can get back to semi-normal, I think. As for the students, I feel like I'm prepared to go in as a new graduate and learn all the things that I should be learning as a new nurse on the floor. But the nursing director says anything is possible. This pandemic is, is unique, but it's not out of, the out of the ordinary. We can have something else like that again. It affected all the nursing programs. A unique experience with lessons unlike any other. Everybody that's going forward like really wants to do this and make a difference and we've seen what that's like. Hager agrees. It shows you the caliber of students that we're getting. Uh, for me, it was nice to see they were instrumental in actually going there. 
Many of the AWC nursing students who helped during the pandemic have now graduated and can now take this unique experience into the workforce. Arlette Youssef, News 11. Good stuff, Arlette, and sincerely, we are so thankful that you nursing students stepped up.